Man, everything kind of halted with that, um, with that Xbox thing loading up, didn't it? What's going on, guys? The Inhuman Beatdown, and I'm here with Batman Arkham Asylum. I also just realized that if I press start on the new game, it was just going to start the game. But yes, this is Arkham Asylum. Note, I am playing the 360 version of this, not the Return to Arkham remasters, just because. Flash the image. Alright, cool, now that we've got that out of the way. Uh, yeah, I just think the detail looks better in the older games. I don't care how shiny the newer versions look for, look at look. But yeah, this has been a long time running. Also, welcome to the beginning of the Night of the Bat. Alright, now that I've gotten that out of the way. This has been a long time in the works that I've been trying to get around to at some point so I could get back to Arkham City. If you aren't aware, Arkham City was one of the first Let's Plays I ever did on the channel with a really crappy iPhone. So, before we get to it, we have to get through its predecessor first. It's time to begin our journey through Arkham Origins. It's worth noting, I am very well adept at these games. It's been a while, but I'm fairly sure I still know how to play them and how to get everything. Let's begin. Uh, brightness, subtitles, yes. Oh my god, 3D display! <laughs> now I had a... That actually does something to my footage and I can't tell. Anyways, um, yeah. <laughs> Let's begin. We're going to do this on hard. Probably going to get my ass kicked quite a few times, but eh, I enjoy the challenge for something like this. The Batman. I considered actually looking at, there is a, um, there's a digital comic that serves as a uh, prologue to this. I considered looking at that too as a part of this, but I was like, hmm... How interesting would it be if I just read all of them and tried to scroll through it by myself? And I was like, I could get some friends to do voices for it, but no digs against my friends. I don't expect them to have, like, good mic good mic settings or, like, the editing and stuff I do for all my stuff. But some of them got some noticeably bad mics. That's all I'm going to say. So I thought about it, and I was like, ah, that could be interesting. But at the same time, eh, eh, it's not worth it. It's... It's like 12, it's like a 12 page mini comic on the PSP, not worth it. Apparently according to the mini comic, he was like, he had some dude shanghaied to a bomb or something. Some Japanese fel uh, fel <coughs> fella or something and with like no other plan and he went down like in one or two hits. to you. Bowles! Yo, Frank, hey, how's the wife and kids? You miss me? Shut it, clown. <gasps> A lot of people here really want to talk to you. <laughs> really? I don't mind walking. I don't think you have a choice in this matter. Not so tight, boys. You'll creep the suit. <laughs> Get that filthy degenerate out of here. Warden, something's not right. I'm going with him. Ah yes, trust Batman to walk into an a into a an asylum full of people he's probably put there. Is Commissioner Gordon here yet? Yes, sir. He's uh waiting patient handle. He got here just before you did. Noted. Sharpie loves his cameras. Hey Sharpie, you getting my good side? Ah, but heck, they're all good, aren't they? <laughs> God God bless you, uh. Look at all this. Holy crap, jokes. I cannot think of Joker's voice actor right now. What? What? Here. Oh my god, no. Don't do this to me. Don't blank on what his name is. Holy crap. Oh god, no. 
the area. Oh, it's always nice to return to my sweet little <laughs> hacienda. Hold on, subtitles aren't working. Let's fix that. Vibration, no. Uh, audio options. So, uh, subtitles are on. I wonder why it's not reading for his. Just the facial looks on Joker. I'm not buying time because I can't remember the actor who does Joker's voice. I just keep wanting to say Luke Skywalker, which is technically true, but also wrong. What's up, Doc? Pencil me in for tomorrow at four. We've got a lot of catching up to do. I wonder if he realizes he's passed all the doctors. Hello, new patient. This is Quincy Sharp, warden of Arkham Asylum. Ooh, it's when my favorite show. Hi, warden idiot. You'll never escape. <laughs> hey, it's Joe. Joe, go, 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 shut up, go, get you soon, boss, shut it, I'm telling moving. you, the go, state go. of the wiring in these shut federal facilities is, well, it's shocking, my boys over there could have been hurt in that unfortunate fire, yeah, so apparently Blackgate had a problem, so a lot of Blackgate just people got moved over to, uh, bowls. whatever, just be quick, hi, Steve Bloom, Only following procedure, Patient seems to be in satisfactory condition. Looks like he suffered minor lacerations, probably in the last two hours. There seems to be. <laughs> Need to take my temperature? I'd be happy to drop my pants. I'm sure you would. Yours. Get him out of here. He's good. Get the door open. I can't believe I forgot Mark Hamill's name. I feel ashamed of myself. <sighs> Honestly, this entire opening is just Mark Hamill going wild as Joker, honestly. You are the lady. We got another psycho on the way. Can you smell the excitement in the air? No? Hmm. It must have been one of the guards then. Croc, old boy! Is that you? Hmm, that looks terrifying. Also, I like how Killer Croc basically went from, oh yeah, he's a guy with a skin condition and it makes him look like a croc and also he's super strong, to whatever the hell this version is. What's it doing? I've got your scent, Batman. Also, he I follows me. Hunt you oh, down. I just wanted to really highlight that detail. Sorry, he actually I follows you. Stop me from killing you, Batman. I'll rip you apart. Eat your bones. That reminds me. I really need to get me some new shoes. Okay, sheep. move up. I like that the cops have just let Batman come in here. Like, usually, like, everyone's apprehensive against Batman and stuff like that. Whee! Great night for a party! Not where you're going. <laughs> the night is young, Bats. I still have a trick or two up my sleeve. I mean, don't you think it's a little bit funny how a fire at Blackgate caused hundreds of my crew to be moved here? <laughs> I thought I told you to stay quiet! Oh, Frankie, you really should learn to keep that fat mouth of yours shut. 
It'll get you into trouble. Tell me something. You've never let me catch you this easily. What are you really after? Oh, nothing much. Hundreds dying in pain and fear. All their meaningless lives brought to a horrifying conclusion. Yeah, that All sounds like Joker. To you and a book of matches. Was that the answer you wanted? All patients should avoid contact with prisoners from Blackgate Prison Facility. Their presence. <laughs> What's he doing? Stay where you are. Get a flashlight. Get a light on him. Don't worry, he's not going anywhere. What? Don't you trust me? No, not really. Our guest has arrived. Intensive treatment, lower floors. God, I'm just getting filled with so much nostalgia playing this opening again. It's been so long since I've touched this game. Busted out of here. Feeling wonderful pants tightening feelings. I'll be sure to try harder next time. What say we aim for a hundred? Long night, Jim. <laughs> Joker invades City Hall and holds the mayor hostage. Was it the mayor? The media, I don't think so. Teams, the media, and you. Yeah, it's been a hell of a night. Hopefully the last one we'll ever have with him. Yeah, about that. Hold it there. Sorry, Batman. Arkham staff only. I assure you, if anyone's qualified, it's... Uh, listen, I appreciate the assistance, but he'll unsettle the more violent inmates. <laughs> I think he's talking about you, Bat. Don't be a stranger. You're always welcome here. Also, why would they I let Joker walk with his hands in front of him? You okay? He surrendered almost without a fight. I don't like it. At least he's Obviously there's some contradictions between the the comic and this. I think the comic was made after the fact. Get up. Now. <laughs> Joker's loose. Alert the warden. The joke's on you. Honey, I'm home. Come on in. I will miss this voice actress for uh for her. I don't dis Nah, I'll get to that later. Now let's get this party started. There we go. I'm sure. Avoid damage by countering incoming attacks. Trust me, I know. So as you can tell, I'm still pretty good at this. So what we've got here is we have a basic system that would be later emulated by a ton of people. Extra attack, wide counter abilities, and then mix and match some other stuff that they haven't told me how to do yet, but I still remember how to do. Also, jam. We're stuck in here. Joker's in full control of the security gates. I'll find a way out. Gordon, try and contact the warden. Let him know what's happened. I'll be back. Don't make promises you can't keep, Bats. I'm in control of the asylum. You're not going anywhere I don't want you to. Understand? If you think I'll let you run... <laughs> Can do. You know it's a trap. Of course it is. All right. So what I was gonna say was basically, uh, uh, was that I still that I'm using some stuff that they still haven't 
that they technically haven't taught me how to do yet, but I still know how to do it and everything. And there would be uh, indicators above their heads when to counter them. But since I'm playing on hard difficulty, they actually remove that, which is what that warning was at the beginning. But as you can see, I'm still pretty well off without it. I got hit once at the beginning. Also, it batterings. Or you can just tap, like multi-tap, just to fire it quickly. It was Joker T full server purpose. I mean, aside from giving me experience, which, yes, there's kind of an experience system to this. We'll get into that later. We're right now basically in, like, the beginning parts. These poor guards never stood a chance. All patients should take their medication. Every day. Warning. Security breach in level B3. Oh, hi. Security breach in level B2. Ow. You want some of this? Warning. Security breach in level B8. Warning. Security breach in level B1. Good night. There we go. There's a case of me kind of getting my ass kicked a little bit, just because still got to adjust to this being the first game and it, like, not being as loose with some of its stuff yet. Joker's escaped custody. He's running free in Arkham. Do you need anything? Is my dad still there? Commissioner Gordon is safe. Joker's not far ahead. I'll stay in contact. There we go. Oracle, of course, being Barbara Gordon after she got paralyzed. Also, this guy was talking to me, and I just kind of ignored him. What happened? Joker happened. You're lucky to be alive. He must have gone this way. Door's jammed. I'll try and get it open. We need help and pacification. I repeat, we need backup and pacification. Can anyone hear this? Can you hear me? I'm with Batman. Hello? Where are they? Back down there. Do you need help? No. I work better alone. Zaz is free! Oh, God! He's got Mike! Diane! Franklin, can you hear me? If you can, help's on the way. Oh, good. Zaz. Awesome. Not necessarily my first choice of villains, but also not one I knew before this game, if I'm going to be honest. We'll get more into him later. Let him go! You'll only end up in more trouble if you continue! Please, you've got to save him. Thank God. It's Zaz. He's got Mike. He's strapped in the chair. Zaz has totally lost it. Wait here. You can't. He'll kill Mike if he sees anyone trying to get close. He won't see me. <laughs> I see anything that looks even a little bit like a bat, and this guard dies. Do you hear me? <laughs> So, Zaz, if you aren't aware, very classic, uh, cla classic psychopath. He didn't really have any powers or anything. He's just a crazy man who kills people and cuts scars into his skin to keep track of his body count. He's got a spot on his forehead he's saving for when he kills Batman. Zaz has got I my body. He's gonna fry him. Do something. He Please. Dies. Keep him occupied. I need to get behind him. Victor Zaz. True psychopath. Zaz grew up in a life of ease, but nonetheless became a serial killer. Indiscriminate in his prey, body count is the only thing that matters to Zaz. He takes pleasure in arranging the corpses of his victims in lifelike poses before carving a mark for each of his victims into his own body. He's saving a special spot for the Batman. Facts, what? Victor Saz, professional criminal. Oh, Shadow of the Bat. Huh. He came out almost a year after I was born. Nice. Psychopath, no regard for human life, no pattern of killing, making him difficult to track, compulsive need to kill others. Goody. <laughs> Fantastic. Uh, we've got the others, of course. It's like Batman, you know who he is. Joker, you know who he is. Oracle, daughter of uh, Gotham City's police uh, commissioner, Gordon James, Barbara Gordon. 
Uh, for Ben Barrett, protect father from joining the GCPD and said she looked at the identity of Batgirl, crime fighting partner of Batman for years, but all that ended when Joker shot her through the spine, paralyzed from the waist down and confined to a wheelchair. Barbara adapted the new identity of Oracle and now aids the Dark Knight with her computer expertise, providing Batman with a constant stream of information on the field to aid his battle against crime. Basically, she became a tech, tech expert. Uh, Warden Sharp. Quincy Sharp has been running Arkham Asylum for the past three years, dedicated to his life of restoring, uh, life to restoring, to restoring to sanity the so-called supervillains that plague Gotham City. He is currently campaigning to become the next mayor of Gotham. To facilitate his campaign, he has instigated a stringent new security and experimental research policies at Arkham. Batman Arkham Asylum. <laughs> He's apparently exclusive to this game. Uh, of course, we know who Commissioner Gordon is, and that's it. I've got to get close enough to Zaz to strike. He'll see me coming on the ground, so I'll stay up high. He's detective mode. Something later games would rip off wholeheartedly. These old gargoyles should be able to support my weight if I grapple up to them. Basically, from here we can grapple around. From a kick, uh, focusing the camera on the enemy. Hey, Zaz! Hi. Zaz is down, but not for long. No, he's down. Trust me. Someone I've been using that move for a himself. while. So I didn't need the game to tell me about it. When did they kidnap him? I'm now subbing for the old man. Old Sharp has never been happier. In case you ain't figured it out, today is the Joker's big homecoming, and you're the guest of honor. You have one chance to surrender, Quinn. Tempting path, but no dice. Now the inmates are running the asylum. Well, technically, the Joker's crew shipped him from Blackgate, but you get the idea. Bye-bye for now. Batman, you picking this up? Oracle, I'm here. Arkham Asylum just vanished off the network. He's in control of the security system. He's probably isolated it from the grid. That's not all he's done. All police feeds are reporting he's placed bombs all over Gotham. Says he'll detonate them if anyone sets foot on Arkham Island. It's being suppressed at the moment, but the story will break any time now. He's lying. It's just a diversion to keep people away. How do you know? I know him. <laughs> I know him. I can't open the gate. It's trapped in here. Try the radio. Control should be able to shut down the gate. Harley thinks she has me trapped in this chamber. She never was very bright. Also, also, of course, got the character bio for Harley Quinn. You should know who Harley Quinn is. Uh, but what I was going to say, though, was um, I'm actually, I, I like this voice actress for Harley Quinn a little bit better than I like her future voice actresses or future voice actress, because I think after this, she gets predominantly uh, replaced by Tara Strong. And I don't necessarily hate Tara Strong's performance. I don't necessarily like Tara Strong as a person, but I, I I don't know. She's all right, but it's not the same. I don't hate it, but eh, I preferences. You know how it is. Hey, Batman found a way out. He's just been off the wall. Yeah, I can do that. Batman, I'm patching you into the guard radio feed. Steve, more Blackgate prisoners. By the boiler. Who's that behind them? It's Joker. He's free? How'd he break out? Sorry, feed's down. Comms are up and down like crazy. It's not good. I'll keep trying. <sighs> Riddler trophies. Of course, the Riddler. Obsessive compulsive need for attention. Edward Nigma is determined to be the most 
outlandish of Gotham City's criminals uh, concocting elaborate series of clues and riddles around his crimes. Batman has proven a worthy opponent capable of deducing the Riddler's plans, but Enigma is dedicated to creating a mystery the Dark Knight will not be able to solve in time. Uh, Eddie Nashton. Not the name I would have thought. 1948... Genius intellect, driven by a need to taste his wits against law enforcement by leaving clues to his planned crimes, compulsive need for attention. Sounds about right. If I remember right, uh, Daddy didn't love him enough. And Daddy didn't love him enough and also kept thinking he was cheating at everything. But uh, we'll talk about the Riddler trophies later. Just uh, if you're not familiar with the franchise, you'll, you'll get acquainted with them very quickly and you will come to hate them. Joker toxin. Listen, the room is full of poison gas. Anyone caught in there is dead. Are you gonna get in there and help them, Batman? Of course. Why wouldn't I? Nah, I'm just gonna leave them. They're all dead. Fuck them. Uh, because they're probably laughing themselves to death. This isn't a simple escape attempt. Joker's been planning this. What's that? The Joker plan? A big, here. extravagant Please. plan? You're gonna be fine. Stay here. Batman's here! Just hold on a little longer, Steve. I can't! I'm gonna fall! Howdy. I'm going after the animal who did this. Batman! The extraction system! Steve was trying to get to the... I can't believe he left me here. That son of a... Howdy. Good night. Don't worry, game. I know how to play. Trust me. So we can see the cops uh, did not make it out. I mean, he didn't stand a chance to begin with, anyways, but neither here nor there. Kind of surprised some of these guys just got left in here. Actually, no, never mind. I'm not. It's Joker. So close. You can almost taste me. How did Joker have enough time to spray paint all this stuff in here? Oh, hi. There we go. Not the best, but eh, it'll do. No real variation to it. You get more experience, the more variation, more stuff you do in combat while keeping uh, the combo going. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, be sure to leave it a like. And if you wanna see more of my future content, be sure to hit the subscribe button. And to stay up to date with all of the releases that come out daily, be sure to click that bell. And if you're feeling a little bit generous, why not check out my Patreon page? Link is down in the description. And as always, until the next video, hasta.